Route 66, dubbed the Mother Road by author John Steinbeck, is one of America's most iconic highways, passing through eight states and three time zones. Travelers on Route 66 will see a diverse range of scenery, from the towering woodlands of Missouri to the flat plains and ranchland of Oklahoma and Texas. Although Route 66 was officially removed from the United States highway system in 1985, parts of the original highway route as well as alternate alignments still exist and you can see and visit many of the same scenic stops that made up the original Route 66. Expect to see iconic neon signs, time capsule towns, curbside classic cars and ribbons of tarmac vanish into the distance. So hop in the car and prepare to be dazzled as we explore the best stops along the legendary Route 66. The starting point for Route 66 in 1926 was at Jackson Boulevard at Michigan Avenue in Chicago. But you can start at the recent Begin sign, located on East Adams Street at Michigan Avenue. One of the first stops on Illinois Route 66 is the Wilmington Chamonix Giant. The Chamonix Giant is one of many giant classics found along many routes in the United States, including Route 66. These massive fiberglass statues were built in the 1960s and 1970s to promote roadside businesses, which were often automotive shops selling car exhaust silencers, also known as mufflers. The Gemini Giant, a 30-foot tall statue wearing an astronaut's helmet and holding a rocket, is the first muffler man you'll encounter on Route 66 heading west. The statue, which bears the name of the Gemini Space Program, was placed here in the 1960s to promote the launching pad drive-in restaurant. From Wilmington, you'll arrive in Pontiac where the Route 66 Hall of Fame and Museum is a must-see. Most states along the route have their own Route 66 museums and you should definitely visit at least one or two of them. Continue on from Pontiac to Springfield, Illinois for your first classic Route 66 food stop. And the first dish you should try is the Cozy Dogs at Springfield's Cozy Dog Drive-In, which has been a Route 66 staple since 1949. When you arrive in Staunton, Make a quick stop at Henry's Rabbit Ranch. Henry's Rabbit Ranch, built in 1993 and inducted into the Illinois Route 66 Hall of Fame in 2012, serves as a charming and eclectic visitor center. Aside from real rabbits, some of which can perform tricks for visitors, the roadside attraction also includes a row of half-buried Volkswagen rabbits. Before leaving Illinois, Stop in Collinsville to see the world's largest ketchup bottle and in Madison to see the chain of Rocks Bridge. With great views of the river, this bridge is a great place to stretch your legs on Route 66. When you arrive in Missouri, your first stop should be in St. Louis to see the Gateway Arch. The 630-foot tall Gateway Arch is the tallest monument in the Western Hemisphere and a must-see for all Route 66 visitors. You can take a tram tour to see the expansive view from the top of the arch. Another excellent stop is Missouri's Route 66 State Park. The park, located in Eureka, offers four hiking and biking trails, a playground for children, fishing spots on the Merrimack River and information about the Mother Road. Located near the towns of Sullivan and Stanton is one of the most popular attractions in the state the Merrimack Cavern. This 400 million year old, 4.6 mile long cavern system can be visited on a guided tour. If you've had your fill of rocks, get in your car and head to Cuba. Cuba is home to several Route 66 attractions, including the Wagon Wheel Motel, the route's oldest continuously operating motel. A series of lovely murals, a restored 1932 Philips 66 gas station, and an operating drive-in theater are among the other attractions in Cuba. A little further along the route, you'll come across Fanning, which is home to a massive rocking chair and is worth a photo stop. The rocking chair is located outside the Fanning 66 outpost, which sells Route 66 memorabilia and souvenirs. From Missouri, Route 66 cuts across to Kansas. Despite being only 13.2 miles long, the Kansas section of Route 66 contains a few notable stops, including the town of Galena, which is worth a visit for the old Canotex gas station, which now houses Cars on the Route, a tribute to Pixar's animated film Cars, and the Galena Mining and Historical Museum. The Eisler Brothers Old Riverton Store, a road trip staple since the 1920s, and the Rainbow Bridge, 
a single-span concrete marsh arch bridge built in 1923 that crosses Brush Creek and is the only remaining bridge of this type along the entire length of the former highway, are two other great stops just west of Riverton. Crossing Route 66 in Oklahoma, you'll notice a small lake on your right where a whale is sleeping undisturbed. Hugh Davis, a local, built the Blue Whale in 1972 for his wife as a 34th wedding anniversary gift. The bizarre sculpture began to deteriorate after the creator's death, but fortunately his son repaired it to its original shape in 1988. This is one of Oklahoma's most recognizable and iconic attractions, alongside the muffler man, gas pumps and neon signs. As you drive west from Oklahoma, you will reach the fifth state along Route 66. Texas. One of the best places to visit in Amarillo is the Cadillac Ranch. The Cadillac Ranch, unquestionably the most famous attraction along Texas Route 66, is a 1974 art installation. The site contains 10 Cadillacs half buried in the ground, with the tail fins protruding into the air. Spraying your own designs on them is a must. The Big Texas Steak Ranch is also a draw here. Famous for its 72-ounce steak challenge in which, if you can finish a 72-ounce steak, shrimp cocktail, a side salad, a buttered roll and a baked potato in an hour without getting sick or leaving your seat, you get the $72 meal for free. And don't leave without taking a photo with Adrian's midpoint sign to prove you've made it halfway. When you arrive in New Mexico, the best place to stop is Tacumcari, which perfectly embodies Route 66. You would find TP Curious, a former gas station and market from the 1940s. A number of local museums, including the Mesa Lands Dinosaur Museum and neon lit diners and motels. Further along the road in New Mexico, you'll come to Albuquerque, where Route 66 runs through the heart of the city. If you like road trips like this one, be sure to watch our video featuring the 10 best road trips in the United States. When you arrive in Arizona, your first stop should be the Petrified Forest National Park, where you can see centuries-old fossilized trees and the colorful painted desert. Also, don't miss a stop at the infamous Wigwam Motel in Hallbrook for a chance to spend the night sleeping in Wigwams. After that, head out to Winslow to see the Standing on the Corner Park, which was created as a tribute to the song Take It Easy, and take a quick detour to the Meteor Crater. And your final stop before leaving Arizona should be at Oatman to see the daily Wild West shows and the wild burrows roaming around, hoping to entice food from visitors. If you enjoyed this video, it would be super helpful for the channel if you'd support us via the super thanks button. Thank you! California is the final stretch of Route 66 and there are a few more stops to make before you reach your destination. The Roy Motel and Café with its bright neon sign should be your first stop here. Despite the fact that the motel is closed, the café is still open for a quick cup of coffee. The next stop is Amboy Crater, a 250-foot high volcanic crater made of ash and cinders. Use the hiking trails to stretch your leg in a beautiful desert setting. Moving on, stop at Elmer Long's Bottle Tree Ranch to see a glass forest built by Elmer Long, who inherited his father's impressive collection of empty glass bottles. You can also stop at another wigwam motel, but your final stop will be at the end of Route 66 in Santa Monica, where an end of the trail sign on the bustling Santa Monica Pier will signal the end of your journey. After arriving in Santa Monica, you should explore Los Angeles. Be sure to watch our video featuring 104 things to do there, 